New at 9, a St. Louis man is asking, how do we get teens to pick up a book instead of a gun? That is the intent behind new billboards that recently popped up in the metro area. Fox News' Chris Hayes talked with the man behind the message. Chris. Jasmine, Aaron Williams wants people to look at something we see every day as a reminder. The streetlight. The battle belongs in the household, and the, this campaign is to say we could win this battle one household at a time. Through his nonprofit called the Seventh Grade Poetry Foundation, Aaron Williams has purchased billboards and bus signs that say, when the streetlights are on, do you know where your children are? This one is on I-40 near the Armory. A grassroots approach to trying to return what is ingrained in the St. Louis tradition for multiple generations. His message has caught the attention of stakeholders across the region, such as Wellston's mayor, Nathaniel Griffin, who remembers the street light rule when he was young. We play football, and if I'm going for a winning touchdown, ball in the air, street light come on, I'm going to, I would rather lose that football game, let that ball hit the ground, because I did not want to face my mom knowing that I let the streetlight catch me. Griffin himself runs a youth basketball league to give teens an alternative to the streets. He's currently working on renovating a gym and a game room in their new city hall location. So if we don't have those safe havens in our community, then the kid is on the streets until mom get home. And so it's a catch 22, but it's definitely a campaign that needs to happen because it holds the kid and the, and the parents accountable. That's the rule in St. Louis. And so over and over again, Everybody said it's all about street lights. This current generation just seems to have forgotten it. 140 of these messages are already on every Metro bus and then another three on billboards, one on I-40, I-55 and I-70. Live in University City, Chris Hayes, Fox 2 News.